Have you ever wondered how far Geometry Dash statistics can go? Well, in this video I'll talk about the biggest Geometry Dash numbers to ever exist in the game. These statistics vary from smaller numbers to extremely large numbers, and they will exponentially get larger until we reach the peak of Geometry Dash stats. Without further ado, let's get into the video. If you have played this game for a little bit of time, you might have noticed some weird levels called the hardest jump in Geometry Dash. Most of these are just some troll levels, but some definitely belong to the hardest jump category. So I was like, why not find out what the biggest jump in Geometry Dash is? Out of all the speeds there are, I chose the fastest one, the 4 times speed change, and then gradually made the gaps larger and larger. And after 1 hour of trying, there can be concluded that the biggest jump is 6.586 spikes on 60Hz, which is 6 spikes and 8.8 .8 editor frames. But this isn't big whatsoever, so let's take it a little further. So the next one is very, very weird, and you probably have never even heard about it. The reason for this is that this thing occurred just 8 months after the release of GD. On the 14th of May 2014, the servers were hacked by a person that I don't know the name of. What he did was very strange. He changed the maximum number of stars you could get from a level from 10 to this number right here, making these 3 levels the most valuable levels in GD, with 127 stars to gain from beating this. Another pretty big number has to do with these types of levels. Daily levels are most of the time good levels that are mentioned in this tab, and are changed at exactly 12am EST. However, the amount of these are pretty big. There are around 1960 daily levels that have been made in the history of GD, which means they have been in the game for a little over 5 years if you don't count the levels from GD Worlds. There are millions and millions of IDs, and some of these are very old. Most of these old IDs are forgotten, but there is one ID that is still known to most people in the community to this date. This is ID 128, the very first ID in Geometry Dash, which was created in September 2013, just one month after the release of the game. This means that it is around 3165 days old, which might not sound too much, until you think about the fact that this is probably 10% of your entire lifespan. However, let's now take a deeper dive into the extraordinarily big numbers. If you think about the most liked post for example, you probably think about a comment from Michigan or Raptop since they are very popular, but there of course are a couple of people who can easily beat this number. Hackers. Even though most hackers don't target the profile post like system, I found one who might have the most likes on the profile comment to ever exist. Mr. Margaruda has exactly 1,037,538 likes on their post that they added by some sort of hack making this possibly the most liked post in Geometry Dash. Okay, so with all these weird things happening in the game, there obviously must be an incredibly large amount of accounts. But how large exactly is this player base? There are two types of different accounts, yellow and green ones. The yellow ones being actually registered accounts, and the green ones being terminated, probably because of bots. These bots sometimes spend thousands of levels on an account and later get removed. If you check an account on GD Browser, you can see their user ID, which basically is this large number, which counts all these numbers in total. And the most recent one I could find had a number of 203 million, which is definitely pretty big, but just a small percentage in comparison with what I'm about to show you. The player with the highest jump count for example is a bit harder to determine, since it will always keep increasing, which is why I asked the help of some experienced GD players. They showed me some crazy stuff and one of them was the world record in jumps based on their knowledge, which is held by Raider132. Raider made a level where he was able to jump 2000 times per second, and he did this for a very long time, until he reached more than 100 million clicks in just one simple level, also making him the current record holder for the most jumps in GD. But let's take it a little further than that. Instead of just getting these statistics from one simple person who jumped in a level, what would be the estimated jump count from everyone who plays Geometry Dash? This obviously cannot be accurate, but I tried to get an estimate. So based on this website, 1.1 million people are actively playing GD, having played the game between now and 2 weeks ago. I will only count these people together with another group that I'll talk about soon. To figure out the average jump count per player, I hosted a forum where more than 100 people put their jump count in it. I took an average of these numbers, which was a little over 1 million, and finally it was multiplied by all the active players, together with the mobile ones, and the result is that there should be around 24 trillion total jumps in the game, which is pretty crazy. Another statistic that blew my mind is the biggest amount of clicks in any level. Rated levels like these called WoW and New Record have a ton of clicks in them, but that's nothing in comparison with this level right here. A level called Tower is currently the level with the most clicks in it, out of all the 80 million levels, and has more than 30 trillion clicks in it. 
It only is possible with a very high amount of frames per second, but not that it matters since nobody's gonna beat this anyway. So I talked about all the jumps in GD based on an estimate, but how about the actual average time spent on Geometry Dash by everyone who plays this game? In the entire lifespan of Geometry Dash, there were on average 3643 people in line. In 24 hours, this means that 87k hours are spent on the game, which is more than the player with the most amount of playtime. And if we go from 24 hours to 8.67 years, aka the age of the game, we can conclude that people have played GD for 276, 363,808 hours, which might be smaller numbers than the stats before, but way more insane in my opinion. However, there's one statistic left, which is way greater than everything I've covered until this point. Okay, so in the game, everyone is able to create one username. Every username consists out of a few letters and numbers, and there's nothing crazy about it. Except if you take a more thorough look at it. Since there are so many people who play this game, there are a lot of variations possible when it comes to usernames. But how many exactly are there? The length of a username can be 3 to 15 characters long, and can use 36 different characters. But the real magic comes when we combine these two. The amount of variations possible from characters in your username is 2.2 times 10 to the power of 22. Shortly said, 2.21 sextillion variations, which is a pretty decent amount I'd say. If you liked this video, also watch this one about the most unlucky moments in GD. Goodbye.